Well, welcome back to Good Morning Northwest. I'm already hungry thinking about the story, story, story. Oh my gosh, it's Wednesday. It I'm so Wednesday. hungry, I'm like practically drooling, drooling and can't even speak. Well, can we go to the video? Let's, Let's go to the video. video. This sizzling hot Tex-Mex favorite, yes, that I keep tripping over my words for, was created in the 1930s by Mexican cowboys. You can smell it through the television. Know, right? Marinating the cuts of meat. That's how we make them. <laughs> they used to be thrown away, it makes them more tender. In fact, the word fajita means little strips of meat. Mm. The meat is traditionally cooked over an open fire or grill, as you see here. And once cooked, you can build your own taco with a tortilla. The dish is now a favorite across the country and personal favorite of mine. Be sure to dress it up with pico de gallo, guacamole, veggies, and my favorite is to caramelize those onions. It takes around 30 minutes. I'm so happy to have Got Taco it. Tuesday. And then Wednesday's National Fajita Day. Yes. We'll have to come up with another yummy Thursday. Friday's here and then it's the weekend. I know, and hopefully next time I don't drool all over my words. <laughs> <laughs> hey, but hey, if you bring in fajitas next Wednesday, I don't care what, what you we do. do. Yeah. yeah, we'll just be happy and full. Let's do it. Well, just make sure you use the cast iron grill because I will tell you that that made my fajitas did it top notch. There you go.